Hey guys and gals, Mike Cricket 113, and this is the President Harrison FCC approved AM FM CB radio for 11 meter. A, uh, I have had a couple videos I've already put up in shorts uh, explaining uh, a little bit about this radio. Uh, and as uh, in a, my original video, I said I was going to explain the CT, CSS tones, and DCS tones that you can now use in FM mode only on the uh, 11 meter President Harrison radio. So uh, why would you want to have C CTSS tones or DCS tones uh, on FM on your 11 meter radio? It might be scratching your head, it might be a waste of time, but no, it's definitely not, definitely not. Um, when uh, President came out with and Cobra Radio came out with FM, AM, uh, CB radios, they didn't have uh, they didn't have tone squelch or uh, coded uh, squelch tones or digital coded uh, squelch tones uh, at all. So when you were on FM, you were still hearing all the other signals on AM. Now, I have it parked on channel 6, as you see. We are on AM, on the Super Bowl, and I will turn it up. And maybe somebody's out there talking, maybe not, while I make this video. But you hear those signals out there making noise. There's one. I'm going to the top of the I'm going to the top of the pot. Watch my back. I'll be back in a minute. I'm going to the top of the pot. Ba, ba, ba. All right, that signal went up to an S9. So imagine you want to use channel 6, uh, which is 27025 on your, uh, on your CB radio, but you want to use FM, okay? You want to use FM, but you don't want to hear that guy blasting through while you're talking to your uh, your other uh, driver on your convo convoy uh, and you and you want to be able to be heard you want to hear each other what do you do what do you do well you go to FM mode all right now on the Thomas on the Walker 3 uh, you may still hear these operators coming through sorry coming through on uh, AM through your FM you may or you may not. All right, so there's a prime example. I'm glad that operator's still out there. So, so what do you do? What do you do? Well, you buy yourself a President Harrison uh, radio with AM and FM with CT, CSS, and DCS tones. Now, how do you access that so you don't have to hear that guy? So let me show you here. We're gonna zoom in this camera here. Don't mind the, there we go, there we go. You wanna hit the F button, which is the free, the uh, function button. So you wanna hit that, it appears on the screen. Hit it again, a long press. And you wanna to toggle through, these are all your menu functions, okay? There's your SWR meter, your mic type, your PA setting type, you can channel skip, so you don't have to hear certain frequencies, Roger beeps, all that, tones, high and low, and you can go in the negative, your colors, your reset if you screw everything up. But anyway, so what we were saying, you hit your function button once, and then you hit your, uh, you hit it again for a long press, and you wanna find this one here that says, Code RT, ID, and then off. You want to hit that one. So now you want to hit, whoops, see, it kicks you out. So there we are. Now you want to hit the uh, emergency button real quick. And that will say ID. And that means identical mode. Identical mode. ID in the CTSS function means identical mode. Whoops. And uh, yeah, you got to love this. I hit the emergency channel because I have my emergency channel set. So let's go back to that. ID is identical mode. That means on the receive and the transmit, you will have a tone of whatever you're choosing. Now, there's off, there's one. And I'm gonna hit emergency again to confirm 
and now it stopped blinking. So now I'm using a CTCSS tone number one. The list of the tones are going to be in your manual, uh, pretty much near the last page. Uh, all the tones listed. Now those tones are in Hertz. They're subaudible uh, signals that are on your carrier that uh, come over when you when you key up the microphone. On ID, like I mentioned, that is identical mode. So the transmit and the receive is now going to have uh, 0.67 hertz uh, subaudible tone on the carrier. So now, while well, imagine we're in our convoy again, and now we're on FM, and I want to talk to the guy three three uh, trucks back. Now him and we're on the same CTSS tone ID the whole convoy. Now we can talk to each other on frequency modulation without having that AM interfere. Now you see it on the signal meter right now. I'm going to turn the volume up. Now before we heard a garbled mess on standard FM with no tones. Now I got seven, S7 signal uh, coming in from AM on FM, but on the receive, those guys there on AM don't have that CTSS tone, obviously, and they're not coming into the receiver. The receiver's not being opened up. So there you have it, and we can test it here. I have another radio, and I'm going to test it here for you. Now, you might hear a, squ uh, a squeal because I don't know how loud the volume is here, but we're going to test it. This, this is, is my break kit. One, 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 three. three. Yeah, that was a little too loud, wasn't it? <laughs> but you get the picture. Only people that have this radio for right now, or maybe the maybe the uh, the Lincoln Two Plus, because I know you guys opened all them up. But you can use CTSS tones on eleven meter now, and that makes it with FM. That makes it so much better for your businesses, for the four by four community, for locals and friends that want to chat on FM and not have to deal with all that, all that right there. Now you don't have to deal with it because you have the tones right there. This is amazing, this is amazing. The 11 meter community has been using this for years uh, for simplex and, and repeaters and whatnot. Now, now you guys have this now. Now you don't have to buy a 10 meter radio to have this option. Now President Electronics with the Harrison has brought it to you. This is my cricket one one three. Hope you have a good one and take care. And seven three.